new underworld team up against what's probably a new high elf team. Let's have a look. Yep. Two rerolls. No apothecary. Uh, only two block. That's good. Uh, I mean, they're still high elves, so they're probably... <laughs> they, uh... Let's say they're favored. You know, like, it's... Like, remember, there's no Apo. The only reason I got an Apo is because I'm probably gonna use it on one of the rats. Even if it's a badly hurt. Uh, early on. Uh, because remember, we're playing in open, right? So if, if your team gets massacred in the first game, you're just gonna remake it. Gonna do mixed teams? Uh, no. And basically, I, I got an Apo because you can buy everything in Underworld, first of all. So it was a question of, do I want an Apo or do I want another uh, Underworld Goblin? Because I have one spare. Um, and I felt like, you know what, there are some pieces here that it kind of breaks. Like, with an Apo, I have an opportunity to get these guys back on a badly hurt. Um, so I felt like that's probably more important than, um, than getting a 13th Hobgoblin. Also, I don't necessarily want to remake the team, right? Like, if I, if I get murdered, I'm like, maybe we should just keep going, kind of thing. So let's see what we got. Your armor value 7, I can't get to you though. Kind of like the way this looks, to be honest. Uh, we'll do this. Oh, we can't do that. We'll do that. Oh, uh... And yeah, in case we're really stupid, I guess we should do that. Yep. I mean, like, if, if I was playing in champ ladder and I could easily restart, I would not get the apo. But because I specifically don't want to restart, I'm getting the apo. Hopefully that makes sense. Okay, uh, here's the tricky bit. I want to I want to blitz with this guy, but the reason he's he, he's here is because if the if the troll uh, goes really stupid, I can still block here. Success. Two, S two SPP in the bag. Yeah, that's true. I, d I did niggle that line off. So. Oh shit, I did niggle that line off. That might mean they might just concede now and just be like screw this i'll just remake it i forgot we were playing in open and they also got double fame so that's unfortunate for us as long as i can get like as long as i can get the troll back up I think we're still okay-ish. Like, if the troll decides to just stay put, I'll be like, alright. Because right now, they're, like, they're giving me a bunch of blocks here. Like, here's a, here's a block, here's a block, here's currently a block. I'm assuming they're gonna blitz a hobgoblin? Yeah. Oh, and they 
got it. It's fine. Okay. Okay. This guy should really dodge away, but he didn't. Okay. Oh, that made me sad. Oh, snap. Does that change to this? Yeah, no, it doesn't. So we're going to play this safe-ish, like they can chain push me out, I don't necessarily think they will. Um, yes, I would like to dodge. Or not! In any case, Dark is done. 14 months! Random fact, level 3 will have a feature where you can randomly bolt to screen your player by paying real money. Hmm. Well. Yeah, I keep, uh, these guys have, uh, catch rather than dodge, which keep also kind of screws me up when I, when I look at them early on because they're both yellow or yellowish, which indicates agility skill. Like red background is, um, strength skill usually. So this is like, this is not necessarily a super safe place and now they're probably going to block my dudes a bit, which is going to make me sad. But, like, we still have two injuries on them. Which, like, we can't really go... Like, if we go... If we go one-to-one, -one, uh, then they're probably going to win. But, because, you know, their pieces are a lot better than mine. But, you know, this is still... Uh, this is still pretty... Still pretty good. Especially this early. Like, we're also... We're, we're easier to injure, but for the most part, we're actually harder to knock down. Because we have more dodge than they do. Huh. Oh. Oh, that's, that's really good, right? Because now I have a lock here. Yeah, so this doesn't actually change anything, right? Because this removes this, so this is still a uh, two dying. So we'll just stand that guy up, I think. We 
do that. Hmm. doing really well when it comes to um, breaking uh, armor here. Do you want to go stand over here? Oh shit, you do. You're so nice. Also, Rev, uh, Ravenous81UK, just sort of Twitch Prime for 15 months. Thanks so much, and welcome back to the subscribers. So, what's the stats? Uh, we are down to 10 pieces on the field. They're down to uh, 8. Yep. And my cage is still up somehow. I mean, we're still, like, we're still giving away, like, a lot of blocks, which, honestly, I, I, like, I don't really want to do. But, like, you know, at least we're, they're equally bad at poking. And my troll has been pretty well behaved so far, which is nice. Okay, so it seems like this guy's probably gonna blitz this corner. Yep. But it's block on block, so let's see what happens. Oh, well. Things like okay, good, 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 good. Oh, wow, that's uh, that's good for me because that frees up this guy. Means I can do this instead. Oh, very nice. Two, three, four, five. Nice. Um, that's a mistake.
Hmm. Let's see. Uh, we are <laughs> so lucky with our uh, rolls today. Literally, <laughs> all of the all of those blocks have probably been pushers. So uh, we'll we'll see we'll see see what they can do. Like if these guys stand up, they got a two die here, and if that happens, I have to activate this troll. But I can do that with this guy. Hmm. Oh snap! I didn't. That's yeah. See, that's a mistake on my on my end. This is a pretty easy dodge. This is just a three plus two plus, and they can reach. And I think. Like, well, not with, well, one, you know, okay. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. But in, you know. They could try and get a one die. And if that happens, I, I'm gonna have a hardish time dealing with it. So I should have done, could have done another GFI over here. Yeah. Oh, right, okay. Wait, hang on. Yeah, I was gonna. Yep. Yep. Oh! Okay. So, I can pick that up still. Gonna go both down here, because that leaves this guy on the troll, which I like. Um, I'm gonna put this guy here. Nope. I don't want that right now. Thank you. go so I managed to grab the ball again which is great um, and we got three stuns which is also solid yeah so this guy has to do a lot more dodging and this guy Bulls has to do a bunch of dodging. They do have the reroll and the three pluses and two pluses, but it's a decent amount of work. And at least this time around, I have more pieces up here now. They can get this guy closer too, right? By having this guy block here. This guy's pretty stuck, I think. Or rather, he might. This piece might dodge out later, but not right now. Huh. 
Okay, that's good. Because that gives me... Oh, followed up. Okay. Okay, here comes the dodge. Three plus, three plus. Two plus, three plus, two plus, two plus. Holy shit, they made it. No. Yep. Ah, oh, that's good. Uh, let's see how injured you are. Nice. Okay, uh, let's do this. This guy's gonna get a one die here. Uh, I can't really do too much about it. No, that's too risky. Um, let's do this. This forces it to be this guy that blitzes here. And I think this stops. It's. I think this makes it a two die against. Like I don't think they can get remove this assist. So now we've kind of like the Apo's kind of paid for itself, right? In the sense that we now have an extra rat that we wouldn't have had before. I mean, it's still dangerous. We can we can get murdered in the second half, but I think I think that was like that was my intention with getting the Apo. Because once you run out of rats, um, it's going to be harder to do things, especially against elves. I I need to wait until turn eight, which is the problem because these guys can easily score on two turns. Ooh. Oh. Oh, I don't think that's the correct. Well, it wouldn't have mattered. Oh no, it would have mattered. Uh, because now I can blitz here. 
And if I'd done it the other way around, uh, it would have been... This guy would still have been stuck. Now he's free to move. Okay, so that went well. Okay. So, so far so good. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's doable. Well, I mean, you know, under the circumstances. Uh, don't think it's very likely to work, though, but. Unfortunately, also, this build kind of does not let me do that much fouling. But then again, I'm, I pro I'm probably, like, I'm not in a game play state where fouling would matter anyways. They, hmm, I think, yeah, looks like they're just going to let me score here. I do have a reroll, so I am going to make this blitz. do that when we have rerolls he said being very aware that um that has happened several times when i don't have rerolls okay so we have a full team let's see if this guy comes back yes he does so they're down to nine um We are going to leave the uh, the troll into hobgoblins up on the LOS um, because they're harder to knock down. They might. Uh, I mean, it's not that hard to knock the troll down here. Like block, block, and then get one of these guys to actually get knocked down. Follow up. Then you have then you have a two die. But it's still the piece with armor value nine, right? And these are elves. They're not going to foul it. 
If I, like, if I were to do uh, some of the rats, I feel like it's way more likely that they actually get injured. For a second, I was super worried that they were going to get a riot and get two turns. Because then I'd be like, damn. It's, uh, it's going to be rough. Yeah, like, that was an, that was an 8 into a 12. That would have, uh, that would have injured a rat too. So... Well, except for the storm vermin or Skaven blitzers, but I, you know, I'd much rather have a hobgoblin out than uh, than a rat at this point. There are there are parts where the hobgoblins then suddenly get amazing. That's when they get two heads and just run through everything. Okay. Let's see if they knock it down this time around. Yes, they did. This might actually be a foul because of the way it's surrounded, but I don't think so. Like, I don't think it's worth it, consi considering how I'd played with the troll and the fact that it doesn't have any skills. Okay, roll a double. Oh, num, num, uh, number of the bidet brought both the casualty and the touchdown. We have to remember that. So they still have nine pieces. That's, you know, that's scary enough. Because I think, like, did I get rid of any... Did I get rid of any important pieces? Yeah, I did get rid of the catcher. Uh, you know what? Let's actually hang out here instead. Oh, no, wait. Never mind. That's too many. Okay. So they can still do like two dive locks here. And they can get a two die. Well, actually. Yeah, they can they can get two die and stuff if they commit more. Hi Thursday, what's going on with the cat? You gonna come down here? New player got a, uh, got a rules question from a game I just played. My wardowns are activated blitz, ran full uh, uh, movement, no GFI, and then leapt into a cage. Then wouldn't blitz. Is that because the blitz would? It's because a leap is always two movement. So, by doing the leap, you activated both of the GFIs, and you need a movement to walk into the square where the piece you're blitzing is. Yeah. 
Oof. Hi, Thursday. Okay. Do you wanna do you wanna lay lay down on the rug? Yeah, you do. Okay. I'm petting this cat's belly. Oh, isn't that nice? Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it seems like they kind of want to push this way, which we, we can kind of stop. Yeah, so this is a one die now because these guys, this doesn't give an assist. Um, well, they can't do that. Oh, and they got it too. That's really unfortunate. Oh, with the follow up. That's nice though. Because then we can go a bit harder here. This with one die. I should be able to do that. Um, ah! like you're not in scoring position, right? Nope. Oh, I should also stand you up. What do you think, per se? Should we do this? Big punch! So the reason to do that is because, well, it's scary, but it's also because we get another one die here now. Which is nice. Okay, so uh, they are down to eight on the pitch again, right? Yep. This guy can easily move the ball, uh, and that's why I moved this piece back. So these guys can, like this guy can't run away from this piece. And this guy should be able to provide assist. And he can be based over here and so forth. But we also have some backup plans where we can block this guy here, push him away. And then throw this guy just backwards to get some more assists if we need to. But like this guy has to move the ball this turn, I think. And it might be a case of might run over here and pass to this guy, which is probably the simplest, and then But might also just run this way and go plop. Oh, sauna and chair. So let's see, we should with that we should be nope. Oh wait, no, you actually really So we're down to and we're down to ten, I think. Three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, so we've got ten. Gold light! Thirty-one month! I started watching your old core. <laughs> Gold material. That's that's old, dude. Like, actually, how old is are those videos? Yeah, so it seems like they're probably going this way. Makes sense. Well, does it? No, it doesn't make sense to blitz that, really. Because you don't need to. Okay, fine. Fair enough. D. 
didn't get it. Oh, it's because you don't want the intercept, because you're going to end up over here. Yeah, yeah. Problem here, though, is that I hand off or run this way? Because I don't think like, you can't really run this way because it's not going to be safe. Um, because this piece is decently free by this guy standing up and this guy blocking. Well, that didn't work. Shouldn't you just face this guy? Okay. Actually, we should, uh... Run this guy back. Oh, we didn't need to stand that guy up. That That's the mistake. Mistakes were made! Well, actually, that's not necessarily true. Let's find out if mistakes were made. Mistakes were made! Uh, because I could have ran this guy back, given an assist, and then this guy would have been three. One, two, three, four. Now I have to do this. See, one, two, three, four, five, six, yeah. Okay, it's time to do that. Holy shit, it didn't go horrible. Uh, we'll stay put. Hmm. Oh yeah, you can get there, so. Yep, I think that's better. I don't want to try ri uh, risking picking it up. Holy shit. That dude just leveled up, I think. Yep. Num number of the bidets going hog. Like, it's just wrecking face with these elves. I'm pretty sure... Wait. I wonder if he injured both of the catchers. Wait, who... Oh, right. It was one of the... No, it's the troll that did the other one. Hail Mary Pass, first skill up. No. No! Uh, for those, for those wondering, uh, the tr ouch.
Okay. Time to be safe and boring. I guess not that safe and boring. No, I I don't know if I mentioned mentioned it or if I got caught uh, cut off by other things, but generally, give all your rats block. The fir literally the first thing you do, you give them block. Because no one else on the team is going to get block and you need more block. Then you can do other things. The uh, I mean, the throwers on a uh, on an underworld team aren't, they're not, they're not here because they have pass and pass and sure hands. They're, well, they're here because they're ball carriers but never ever going to pass the ball anywhere. Oh yeah, you can give a line rat wrestle if you need to, but Underworld, or the way I play Underworld at least, is Underworld is a um, is a glass cannon uh, murder team, kind of kind of like Norse, uh, except they're better because they they're gonna get three pieces that have claw mighty blow. Uh, and those pieces being the Warpstone Troll and both of the Blitzers. Um, and then all of your hobgoblins are going to get uh, two heads diving tackle. So they just run through everything on a 2+. On a Woof. Holy shit. They got it. Then we took it. No, this is still fine. Uh, no, you go that way. It's slightly annoying. What do I do about that? Oh, I, I do this, don't I? Yeah. Uh, I mean... You take that. Uh, I can't block here because if it's a skull, um, this guy just runs through. Golite says, would a gobble uh, after uh, getting diving tackle and two heads just be blowed after that? Or could you argue getting a good double roll of gumbo? Like, this is music on chairs. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna kick pieces. Uh, just, you know, if they get three skill ups. Um, I'm trying. Like, I want to get teams up to TV two thousand at least and see what happens. Uh, but yeah, like hobgoblins. You could make the argument that they get bloaty even after just getting like that. Not all of them need uh, two heads. 
and that they're just fouling machines, if you want. Um, also, that said, Yared Owati just subscribed to Twitch Prime. Thank you so much, and welcome back to the Well, not welcome back, but welcome to the subscribers. Okay, we're gonna... They're gonna block, block me some more. Oh, they're probably... Yeah, they're I was gonna say, they're probably gonna take that. And being like, of course they're gonna take that. They don't have any rerolls. Okay. So. Do I want to do this? Huh. No. I want to I want to win more. <laughs> so, we're going to start by doing this instead. Yep. Welcome to the correct choice haver, population me. That's not how you say that, but... You get what I mean, hopefully. We are going to blitz here, because... I really <laughs> want to use my, my block piece. Uh, sure, we'll follow up. Oh, that's unfortunate. Jeez. Um. Oh, come. Oh, I should have activated the troll before I did that, I guess. Okay, good. That piece is stunned. So, we still got two tackle zones on the ball. How many of their dudes are out now? Four, so they have. Do they have seven pieces left? No, they've got five out, so they've got six pieces left. Three standing. So it's still pretty okay, because we're we've got nine. Well, we've got we've got nine, but we've got eight currently because the troll isn't active. I mean, Tracking Sons, yeah, I, I, sure, Tracking Sons doesn't necessarily uh, mean much, but because they're out of rerolls, I think doing a 4 plus pickup is probably. It's probably not the first thing you do, necessarily. Like, and they have to, to get to the ball, they have, they, they also have to dodge out. Um. Because they can at best get, like, a 1 die here, right? And so that's a two pl oh, oh, and that's a one. Okay, didn't mean to do that, but okay. I mean, I meant to do that, but for some reason I was like, nah, I don't care about tackle zones right now. I'm cool. <laughs> Getting a stun is excellent. Because it lets us go stand over here. Right, I... Oh, no, okay, fine.
Okay. So, yeah, this is this is going real well. The the problem right now is that it's the wrong piece holding the ball. And I'd much rather have probably this piece hold it. So I I am I am going to try a handoff here. Depending on depending on what happens here, right? Actually, this guy's probably going to stand up. I might not. If they don't want me to hurt them no more. We'll see. Okay. Nope. Actually, uh, this is better. Oh, um... I do kind of want to do that, but I should probably then do this first. If I do this, I want you to be here. Go! Cut to the chase! Go! Murder that piece and get more SPP! You did not murder that piece. Can you reach? No. Can you reach? Not really, but... Huh! He's safe. Your troll seems to have pillow hands? Dude, he murdered a, a thing on the first thing that happened. Kinda. Okay, let's see what they do. They do not have anyone in scoring range. Okay, the the nice GG well played and the recognition that they that they did get a dice, which they did, or rather, they didn't necessarily get super dice. More that I rolled really well on on the block die, so it was me getting you know like oh we have to change this. I keep forgetting to do it. Two zero in the first game feels pretty good though. Pretty good. They got armor diced. Yeah, I guess you can say that. I'm gonna re-roll that too into a four. Kung Oh, that is that's great. That's exactly what I wanted. I'm so happy. We got 17 armor breaks. Statistics. 50 blocks versus 29, 4 KOs versus 3, 3 injuries versus 2, uh, 8 yards running 40, let's see, yeah. See, they got like, they got 2 casualties, we used the app on 1, they got 2 uh, pass SPP, so they got decent SPP, but I think they're still remaking that team based on the niggle, the whatever it was, the catcher, I think. We managed to get two straight up to uh, level up. That's kind of nice. Okay. Armor Valley 7 is rough. Catching is rough. Really stupid. He was a, was a really good troll. Injury. Uh-huh. That's nice. Yep. That seems, seems pretty on point. Um, 
this is kind of the same as we had, I think. Ish, uh, which is probably what is probably not what it should be, considering we have lower armor. Um, wake up. Dodge. GFIs went well in catching and pick up and everything. Is it? <coughs> <coughs> so the uh, actually let's go level up but the reason i keep forgetting to swap share leaders is because rather they swap back whenever you upgrade or i think by enhancements they uh they swap back to humans and i'm i don't understand why but they do so and now it should be now it's dwarf as it should be so uh let's see what these guys get Is there anything in agility I want? Nope. Possibly jump up, but... Like, it's too early to get jump up. Like, yeah, jump up is... Like, jump up is solid. Make him blodge? Why? It's a, it's a murder piece. Okay, we'll, we'll think about it some more while we look at uh number of the bid bidet well th this one's easier yeah like here, here's the thing right this is specifically the reason the thing one of the things that um the underworld blitzers have going for them is that they have an easy time like they're fast enough, they're fast enough to score, and they already have blocks, so they get to claw mighty blow a lot quicker. Um, so I think I'm gonna ignore it, and I think we're gonna get mighty blow. That's true. We don't need him to break cage troops, which he wouldn't do anyways, right? Uh, we could, we can get him horns later. Uh, but yeah, I think we're going. I think uh, I think we're going mighty blow, and I I agree. Jump up is not like it's not bad. If we're going claw palm, then it's great. But the problem is that if we get it now, we have to start on the claw palm route later. So we need to get him more SVP, and he generates more SVP the more things he can kill, right? So mighty blow, and then we get claw afterwards. I talked myself out of taking a double. There you go. Excellent. Goodbye, YouTube.